Hey everyone, welcome back to my latest video. Today I'll be doing a 8500 champion chest opening. So we're going to get some more crimson mains. Uh, currently have 8520 champion chests. Before we actually start the opening, let's check what we're actually going for. So in the comments down below, I kind of need some help on what I should go for because currently I'll show you my set just before you guys uh get into this just so you guys know what i'm working with so i'm working with this i currently have two mythic champ pieces the uh main hand and the legs keep in mind this is a rally trap it is not a lead so don't be telling me like lead pieces because i don't care about blast on this account i don't care about like a champion body that just has range in it like that's not going to help me in a mix attack keep that in mind so i'm looking for mixed stuff best in slot mix pieces not best in slot for champion pieces for blasts that leads normally go for. So I'm not going for the cav main hand. I'm not going for the uh, champion helm. I'm not going for the uh, range body. Cause again, that only has ranged attack in it. It's not, it's not helping my mix stats. So um, again, I did get this last time it was the champion valor. So there is obviously an option to go for the mythic version of this. I need 10 more crimson mains. Keep in mind, this is where I'm starting with. I have three commons zero uncommons, uh, zero rares, three epics, and four legendaries uh, to start this off. So we'll try to remember that at the end of the opening. Um, but again, I could go up to the uh, Champion Valor Mythic. Keep in mind, I need 41 Mythic Embers. So that is quite a lot, actually. A little bit less since I have 116 of these. But um, again, that's a lot of Embers, so I'll probably need at least 38 uh, golds or 39 gold something like that so uh, keep that in mind if if we're going for this it's a lot of embers it's not just a lot of crimson mains there is a ton of embers needed to get that to mythic um, the other option is maybe even go for another gold because a gold champion piece is better than the uh, mythic blight ring so um, that is another option go for a second gold champion accessory or I can go for pretty much the offhand the helm or the uh, body and keep in mind I'll be going for mix ones I'm probably not going to go for any blast ones since I don't plan on making this a lead at any point in the in its run I'm just going to keep this as a trap so uh, the offhand is probably going something like champion light or something like that again um, when you go for the champion offhand you are missing some of the HP uh, but the perks of it where am I? Up here. This way. Sorry, I'm going the wrong way. The perks of the champion offhands, obviously, is the very high attack. So I can obviously put some champion jewels in the rest of my gear to make up for the HP lost from the gloves. Uh, and this one already has so much attack in there, it's making up for any attack I would lose from taking out uh, attack jewels. So there's that option. Uh, move some attack jewels out of my uh, my the jewels and then put a champion light in there and throw some champion uh uh champion jewels in there instead so because keep in mind this is so much more attack than the uh the gloves i'm currently running here or it's called uh these ones here the winter mitts um yeah because again i'm getting what am i getting out of this i'm getting 37 percent army hp which is less than three champion jewels because if i was to take out three champion jewels or put three champion jewels into my set that would give me 45 percent hp so more hp i am losing defense though that is well, actually no i'm not because the other thing has defense i'm just losing a little bit of defense actually um but i'm getting a ton of attack because this this piece only has was it like 15 percent range attack or something crazy low like that uh 35 minus 20 yeah so yeah that's uh 15 percent so Again, that's not a lot of attack, so um, by adding in the champion offhand, I'm technically gaining more attack than the 60% I'd be taking out to put the champion jewels in, um, since it has more than 60% more attack than the uh, this. So I, I'm getting positive attack, getting more HP if with the champion jewels in there, and um, just a little bit less defense. That'd be the only thing I'd be missing from upgrading, let's say, this, this thing up to mythic, so. Because yeah, I get 49, 42. So yeah, it's more it's more than 60% more attack. So um, plus I get some training speed. <laughs> and the army defense is a little bit lower. So 
I don't know. I, I'm thinking about that. Or I could go Champion Helm, but the Champion Helm is not a big upgrade over the uh, B Helm, I don't think. Where's the Champion Helm? Again, I'd probably go going the mix ones uh, since, uh, I don't know. I guess I get a lot of HP out of that one, but I'll be losing attack pretty much, I think. Overall, 49. I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll do the calculations after, but... And then champion main body. Again, the range one is what most people go, but honestly, for a mix set, it's not really the best. It, like, you get some decent HP in there, um, decent defense, but the attack is very, very low compared to the other options because you're only getting 56 total attack, and even uh, the firewall plate gives you more than 56 attack. Where is it? Uh, main body, firewall plate. Yeah, you're getting... What is that? 70% attack in there. And you're just getting more HP and defense pretty much in the, uh, you're losing, yeah, you're losing like, was it like 16%, 56? Uh, what did I say? It was 70. So four, four, you're losing 14% to your attack and you're gaining some army HP and army defense from that. So it technically might be a little bit better, but uh, I could probably temper this up and get it better than that or just go champion male which also has more attack as well because this is was that 30 28 uh what's yeah 14 that's 42 attack plus 42 so it's 80 84 attack on this total because again army attack uh defense is pretty close hp is a little bit lower so you get more attack in this than you would uh, where is the uh, other plate? This one here. So, again, you're just getting a little bit more HP and defense. So, anyways, we'll, we'll think about that later. Once I, I'll see how many actual Crimson Mains I get. Uh, technically, I should be getting... Oh, sorry, I should look at Champion Jewels before we do this too. Because the Jewels is also very important here as well. Um, again, we get four extra Champion Jewels. So, it's 33004, if I can remember this. Remember this picture here, 33004. Um, starting off, again, Champion Jewels give Army HP, if you guys are wondering. And I have four extra ones right now that are not in my set. So that's why I was thinking the offhand. I could uh, switch some attack jewels out, put some Champion Jewels in, and put the offhand, and I would have more HP and defense for that slot. So that is an option. So anyways, we'll see how many uh, actual Champion Crimson Mains we actually get from this. Uh, keep in mind, uh, I should be getting around 8 total, um, like total golds, that's including commons, rares, all that added up. I should get 8 because you get about, uh, on average, you get 1 gold per 1,000 chests. Again, it's not a gold drop, but I'm, I'm saying like the actual like total amount added up uh, of these crimson mains added up, you should get uh, 8 golds, or, or at least 1 gold per 8. Or one gold per thousand. Uh, the actual legendary drop, the drop rate is one per three thousand. So if I open almost 8,500, I should get at least two, maybe three golds for all 8,500. And that's just basic drop rates. Again, it's plus or minus. And the more you open, the closer you get to the drop rate. Sometimes you get lucky. Uh, I have got pretty lucky on some of them. Some of them have got unlucky too. So. We'll see. Let's start off right now while we're doing this. Again, we're going to be starting off. Actually, starting off the rare is a good drop here. Um, again, we are looking, obviously, for legendaries if possible. But uh, Champion Jewels, starting off. Again, Champion Jewels drop rates are way lower than the Crimson Main, if you don't know. Crimson Main is a 3% drop rate. This is a 0.5% drop rate. So getting uh, Champion Jewels is actually really good. So again, when I open 100 of these, I should get at least... Uh, three Crimson Mains, which I did not get any on here. And I, I should get basically one Champion Jewel every 200 opened. <laughs> Keep that in mind. Where I should get three, three for every, uh, three Crimson Mains for every 100 I open, where I should get one for every 200 I open for Champion Jewels. And keep in mind the rare epics and uncommons, they all have the same drop rate, where it's like 1% legendary chance. I, I think it's actually lower than 5%. I don't know what the actual drop rate for epics is, but because uh, I don't get that many, and then rares, and then mostly uh, commons is like 60 plus percent. I got like, 
how much did I get here? I got mostly commons there. That's pretty crazy. But again, it's 60 plus percent there. So uh, rare Crimson Mane, that's good. And you can see when I open this, I should get around three Crimson Mains on average. Uh, some are a little bit higher where I got five on this one. Um, the other ones, it should be lower. So again, I don't think the Epic is very high. I don't know what the actual Epic drop rate on the Champion Chest is, but it's almost as low as the Legendary, I swear. Because, oops, did not mean to open that one. But anyways, uh, you can see, yeah, I got three on there. So maybe, is it five? Because this one's only getting three of them, or I'm getting... It must be like 80% for these commons or something like that. I, I don't know. I, I can't find the actual drop rate on it, but I assume that's what it is. Uh, we got three, we got five. Yeah, this might be a 5%. This one might even be lower than 5%. This might be like a 2 or 3%. And this one's a 1%. I'm 100% sure. And this is like an 80% or something like that. So I don't know what this percentage is, like 10 or something? Yeah, I think that might be the actual drop. I'm going to have to read... Uh, re, re, uh, there's another champion jewel. Getting a lot of champion jewels. I don't technically need these champion jewels, but I keep getting a lot of them. I, I'm looking for Crimson Mains here, so again, that's actually good. Getting an epic already. Uh, haven't got any rares or legendaries, or let's call it epics or legendaries. Yeah, this this can't be five percent. I have not even seen five drop on here. Um, this is only two. That's ten. I don't know. I have to find the drop rate. I, I thought I knew it, but I, I'm pretty sure after opening all these, this is not five, and this is not five either. This might be five, but this one's definitely not five. This is one, because pretty much get one legendary every time, but not Crimson Mains. Uh, yeah, I got good there. I haven't got any et or legendaries yet. Uh, yeah, I got five there. Yeah, I don't know what the epic drop rate is. I know I always complain about not getting enough epic uh, Crimson Mains, but I think it's because the... Uh, the drop rate is lower than I think it is. I think it's only like 3% or something like that, or less, because again, I seem to get more legendaries even when opening these than I am getting epics. And another champion jewel. There's a lot of champion jewels in here so far. Not a lot of crimson mains, but uh, getting quite a bit of champion jewels. And I, because I know the champion jewel rate is very drop, very low, but yeah, you can see I got like four crimson mains on there. Just some rares and stuff. Uh, nothing on there. Let's see. Mm, champion Jewel at the bottom there. Nothing on there. Maybe we'll go through these a little faster. How much did I start with? 8,500? So when I get to 5,500, we'll double check and see how many we've got. We haven't got any legendaries or epics yet, though. So let's see. Legendary. Rare. Rares. There's a, a legendary champion jewel. I'll take that, but again, I don't need these champion jewels. It just keeps giving me them. Um, I'm gonna take a screenshot of that one. That was just me turning the volume on. Let's try that again. And it did it again. There you go. Perfect. Finally took this <laughs> screenshot. Okay, I got a legendary crim legendary one. I'll take that. Um. I'll take the champion jewel. I technically don't need them that much though, because I do have four that aren't even in my set currently. I really need these uh, actual crimson mains. 300 left. We'll double check. Again, I should have got. Oh, okay, there it goes. Uh, so that's pretty much on the drop rate. I still have not got an epic, as you can see, because for whatever reason, this account never get never gets epics. So I open like 10k of these champion chests, get zero epics, and get like six legendaries it's like what what is that drop rate anyways so anyways any anyway, well we'll take we'll take the legendary so right literally on the right on the drop rate right now which is good um i'll take that because again yeah we're pretty much one away from being exactly on the drop rate so we'll see what this next one is there you go so yeah we're on the drop rate for that um I, I don't even know if we're lower on the epics because, again, I, I don't know what the epic drop rate is at this point, considering how little I actually get of these throughout the time, so. Um, nothing on there. Boom. That's... Shoot. Actually, I'm just going to go up for one second. How many jewels are these? Yeah, <laughs> look at all mine. I got five of these now, which is hilarious. I could open, I could open all these later, but look how many I got in the first like three thousand. That's way more than you should get. That's way above the drop rate. Again, this as as a zero point five percent drop rate. Of course, uh, I did I get yeah I got a champion epic one too, right? Yeah, and I got legendary. 
bunch of commons, all that. So yeah, that's that's actually insane. Anyways, let's back, go back to open it. There you go. You gotta go out and come back and then you get the legendary Crimson Vein. That's how it works. So perfect. That's our second one already. So we're, we're, we're right on the drop rate at least so far. Um, again, I should only be getting two to three of those for 8,500. Up to three probably is. And, or we just get a second one right after that one. Perfect. <laughs> we'll do that. I'll take that. So now, now, now we're above the drop rate. I am happy so far. This is perfect. Um, see if we actually get an epic. That would be actually interesting if we open all these and not get a sing single epic throughout the whole time. Because um, we've already got three legendaries. See what that's what I'm talking about. Like, how how do you, how is the how is the epic drop rate lower than the legendary drop rate, or is it just my account? I don't know. Because <laughs> again, this this happens like way more often than it should. Because we've opened a ton of champion chests so far on this account, and I I think I've got at least three to four times as many legendaries as I have epics. So again, uh, let's get down to like 30 35. I don't know. Can't remember where our next 3,000 was. Uh, 85, 55, 2,500. We'll stop at 2,500 and check where we're at. Uh, so we'll go through these quickly unless I get a drop. Uh, okay, I got excited there for a second, but those were just non, non Crimson Man legendaries. Go through here quickly. Epics. 3,300. Duh, duh. 3,200. Duh, duh. It's not what I wanted to do. 31. Getting legendaries. It's not Crimson Mains here. Still have not seen a single epic one. I'm not sure why. Why is it like that? There, there's our perfect. Oh, I got, you gotta say epic, so. There you go, there's our first epic Crimson Main after, how many chests have we opened? Like 5,000? <laughs> We've got three legendaries, and then we finally get our first epic, so. Yeah, I gotta really redo the, uh, the drop rates here because it's it's not what I thought it was. Let's go down to 2,500 here and we'll stop and take a look at where we're at. Uh, these last 3,000 I haven't got many uh, uh, what's called champion jewels. Okay let's just go out and check then we'll do the last 5,000 there. Uh, where's our champion? Okay where we're at now. So we're at yeah yeah, that makes sense, because we were at 3 of 3, this was at 3 of 3 here as well. Or 4 of 3. So we got 3 of these, 1 of these, 11, uh, 34, and like a lot of these. So 33? Yeah. 10, 100, 30. Yeah, I'll have to look at the drop rates after this. It's it's way, way different than I thought it was going to be, so... Or at least I th thought where I thought it was. So let's do these last 2,500, see where we get to. Um, see if we can get some more legendaries or non last 2,500. Again, we're already above the drop rates technically, so getting another legendary is not expected, but uh, would be very welcome, obviously. Uh, nothing on there. 2,000 left. Let's see. Yeah. Got four epics on there, or three epics. Ooh, epic crimson silk. No, crimson main is what we need. Got three on there. Oops, used one by accident again. We got to use one and get a champion jewel. There you go, epic champion jewel. We'll take that one for sure. Uh, only got one crimson main on that one. Not a big crimson main drop there, but seems whenever we get a champion jewel on the thing, the crimson rain drop just like goes out the window or something like that. Let's see. Nope. 1400 left. Let's see, you got single Crimson Main on that one. Or single Epic. Uh, obviously, we're getting a lot of commons because that's like an 80% chance or something crazy. Uh, looks like rare on there. Uh, nothing. We got 1100 left. See if we can get another uh, Epic at least. I think it should be higher than <laughs> whatever the drop rate is. Like, is there, I get like a 0% drop rate. Uh, I talk about this every single time I open them, but I don't know why the epic is so low. So, yeah, we're, we're probably not going to get above the drop rate, it looks like, because based on how little epics we got. Um, but hopefully we got at least... Oh, there we go. 
There's our second. Well, I'll, I'll take that. I'll take our second epic of the day with like 400 chests to go. Um, that's good. That's actually higher probably than we normally get. Uh, legendaries. Adamant plates. Veronic fails. Okay, so we're, we're, we're pretty much done here. Um, that's good. I don't think there's any other chests I really wanted to open today, was there? Nothing else I really needed. Yeah, whatever, we can just open these Bond ones too, since I actually need Halos. So I was thinking of building another cup as well, but uh, I am quite far away from that though, so there we go, some rare glowing Halos. Perfect, okay, let's look at what we actually got. We'll go Jewel Chess, Jewels first, just see where we finished off. Looks like we got six of these now, so we got six champion, extra champion jewels. Uh, I think that's enough to put stuff in pretty much every single piece I have. Uh, let's double check. Uh, let's see, I got one here, yeah. So I could pretty much fill my whole set with uh, champion jewels if I wanted. Uh, six more would be 90% more HP on top of this, so I can get up to like 280 something. Uh, 283 it looks like for uh, army HP if I want to take some attack jewels out of here if I was going to do that though I would want to get like a champion offhand just to give some more attack into my set because uh, I'll probably need it um, yeah then obviously maybe go for a higher attack piece here too or something like that oh uh, yeah probably either a cup or a champion piece here as well but I'm pretty far away from the cups yeah, I'm not even close, so I need to get that to Mythic as well, so. Uh, so let's take a look at the champion piece. How close are we to this? Let's fuse all these in. And we're at 10, we started at four. So we're just a little bit lower than I thought we were gonna be, but uh, 10 is still pretty good. Again, we will probably need a little bit more. I'm four off this one for sure. Uh, I don't think that's enough to build the champion offhand either, because I need, where is it? How many, how many does this thing need? This needs six, so yeah, I'm not even at the champion offhand, so I would need a couple more at least, plus obviously these two as well, so uh, probably need like 12 of these, I guess, like 14 of these. So if I get 14, I can either build a uh, full champion light or go for the, uh, the champion valor up to mythic, which, I think I'd get more stats if I went Mythic offhand. I'll have to calculate this later and just double check, but uh, maybe you guys can let me know in the comments what I should do. Should I go for the Champion Valor Mythic next, or should I go for the uh, Champion offhand to give and then put a bunch of like Champion Jewels in my set as well? So, uh, can look at that. Uh, probably take some, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll double check and look at that later because I got six champion jewels I can use right now. So I pretty much have maxed the set for champion jewels with these six extras here. And again, this is not a lead account, so I don't want any blasts or anything I need to use these for. So it's just pretty much pure mix I'm looking for on this account. Um, did pretty good at, on some uh, champion mix attacks as well. I have updated the, uh, the troop comp here. I actually just added more tier four and more tier five into my comp. You can see I'm getting up to that million of each tier five, I'm around 2.5 mil of each tier four. Again, when I upgrade the tier uh, five, it obviously gets rid of some of my tier four because these turn into that. <laughs> That's pretty much it. So I'm getting up there. Soon I'll be a million of these. I'll probably be like 2.5 mil of these at that point too. Um, it's a pretty good comp and then mess around with the tier 2 based on that and it's working pretty good against the The uh, max account mix attacks. I, I've been taking some I've not been taking a lot of damage. They haven't been walking back uh, I will have some more like videos coming out But like this guy hit me yesterday and he did what did he do? Yeah, 1.1 and again uh, I do ask people to break my wall because if I want to go range foul that prevent some walkbacks which I found very useful so anyways hope you guys enjoyed the video today if you have any questions or comments about the account let me know again the code is actually I'm gonna do a second code today so 
um, just stopping the video here like hey it's a code it's a code because people are having problems finding the code I, I literally say it in the video so the code today is mythic champ so mythic champ is the second code and there has been one other code in another video so go check that out hope you guys enjoyed this and i'll see you guys in the next one